So, yep. we are back, and <laughs> Shane is here. We are going yep. to be taking a look at Yahtzee Kroshaw's third game from his Dev Diary series. This is, uh, admittedly his weakest game. This is, are you still there, Shane? I can't hear you. Hello? Why? I can hear you now. I have no idea what made me cut out. <laughs> Shane got a new microphone and he's having trouble with it. So. Yep. Uh, what happens when you leave your cord dangling off the side of your desk and your cat's like, yum. <laughs> Fucking full of teeth marks, man. So, this is admittedly his weakest game in the series. It is also his... He believes it's also the weakest. Uh, the music is by Ian Dorsch, so the music's pretty good. Uh, he also makes the uh, made the Zero Punctuation theme and the Dev Diary series theme, so he, he's got good music. Uh, this is a, a, a rhythm-style game, but it's like a rhythm-style platformer instead of like a rhythm game like uh, Guitar Hero and stuff like that. Yeah, like Crypt of the Necrodancer. <laughs> yeah, kind of like that. So we're going to start here. Start game. Oh, Jesus! Yeah, that's loud. I'm gonna turn down my volume, which is gonna screw over Shane, but whatever. Yep. He can just talk louder to me. Yep. <clears throat> so you can jump in midair to double jump, you can jump against a wall to, to double jump. <clears throat> Press down in midair to quick stomp. Are you Michael Jackson? <clears throat> no, nah, this is uh, a character that he kind of uses. So yeah, you just have to jump in time to the beat, and if you fuck up... Really not good at this. <laughs> Come on, Matt. Get some fucking rhythm. kind of trying to kill myself so I could try to turn down some stuff. Yeah, we're gonna, like, turn that the fuck down. Gonna try it again? Yeah. <clears throat> I guess I feel this is gonna be a short video. Uh, probably, because I'm terrible at this. Yeah, I realized that after 10 seconds. <clears throat> yeah, I'm not. I'm not good. Ooh, difficulty. 
already on easiest. Easy! <laughs> Definitely gonna go with easy, because I am terrible. You start out with only a few instruments, and then you get more. This is a lot easier now. What do you think, Shane? Shane, I can't hear you. I wonder if I'm too quiet for too long, it shuts off or something. It's possible. That sucks. I gotta say, this is a pretty cool soundtrack that they've got going. Oh yeah, it's great. Hundred. Yeah. Don't give me praise, I'm gonna fuck up. Oh. Yeah, it's life. Oh god! I think I attacked the dog. Yep, jump on the dog. Oh god. Be careful jumping off. Oh god. Gotta jump on the dog's head. I don't actually know if you can hurt the dog. Oh god! Quick jump on the dog. What kind of bastard makes you attack a dog in level 1? Come on, jump on its fucking head. I'm trying! Somehow fucking did it. Right? This is the entire game fighting this fucking dog. Basically, yes. The sides always stay clear, remember that. Stop trying to attack in the fucking middle. Shut up. Well, I hope you're happy I do this again. The song has kind of gotten stale now. Well, you were probably supposed to beat this mission two minutes ago. Shut up. <laughs> Alright, fucking bash that fucking dog, come on. No! I died! <clears throat> I fell below the fucking screen. God damn it. You suck. I, I got to almost 300, asshole. Yep. I sure you did. You were barely commentating. Yeah, not I don't want to go over the music. <clears throat> well. Well, you want to do that again, or you want to make this a two-minute video? Uh, well, nine-minute video, but... <clears throat> yeah, I don't want to do that again, really. I figured you wouldn't. <laughs> oh. It is very much not my kind of game. Yep. <clears throat> I'm not into skill-based games, really. Maybe you guys look at two videos today. Like, yeah, I was it's terrible. Really shitty. Like... Years ago, my friend Matt tried- yes, Matt and my friend Matt. There were like ten Matts in our school. We didn't even call them Matts. They went by their last names. Yes, we said at the lunch table, we went by our last names. Because <clears throat> you'd come up to our lunch table, my friend, who wasn't part of the group, would be like, Hey Matt, and twelve of us would go, yeah? 
<clears throat> oh yeah. Turn our heads no, and I, go, yeah. I think my last two years of high school, there was at least two mats in every class I had. Yeah. It was it was like, really was... easy. It was really easy for anybody who wanted to skip class because they could just be like, yeah, it was the other mat. We had a substitute. They marked the wrong one. Yeah, uh, that happens absolutely. all the time. But uh, my friend Matt tried to get me to play Guitar Hero with him or band he- or um, rock band or something like that. Yeah. <clears throat> and like he had to keep saving me because. My brain didn't work well enough, so I could either strum or I could press the buttons on the the neck. It's like could, for me, I could not do chewing gum. <laughs> I could not do I both can't at chew once. Gum at all. Like, I could do one of the two things. I could not do both. Yep. And it's just like I I can normally um, like if I have to like concentrate on something, I can't commentate. That's why I was really bad with pre-flight panic too. Yeah. It's because I couldn't talk while I was trying to read out all the stuff. If I'm, like, killing Nazis or shooting insurgents or something like that or attacking robots in Spongebob, I can commentate all the live long day. But in yeah, something it really like takes this, a lot of power for me, too. I can't read and listen at the same time. Yeah, I have trouble with that, too. Sometimes I'll be typing and I can't talk and type at the same time or listen and type at the same time because I'll end up fucking typing what I'm trying to say or typing what I'm hearing. Yeah, or you're just, like... You're trying to type, and you're just, you just think what you're typing. Yeah. Uh, All right. Yeah. Can... So yeah, this game was uh, very difficult for me. Just like yeah, we were on easy right there. Yeah, and I, I still did pretty well, but I still couldn't talk. It, may, it definitely made it a lot easier for me to get the combo up on easy. Yep. But anyway, uh, yeah, we're gonna move on to. I don't actually remember what the next game is, but we're gonna move on to it, and I'll see you guys. Yep. We'll see you guys then. Yeah, maybe two videos today, because this one's stupid short. Yeah, maybe. Bye. Bye. Oh, good. We're started. I need to be screen shared, by the way. Right. Leave this in. This is good quality content. Professionalism! Alright, so this is the fourth game, I think, in the Uh, Dev Diary series. What? Sound like you just made a cut there. I did not. You better not. I'm, I'm not editing this on the fly. <laughs> <clears throat> so hello, you've already... We're back. Yep. Yes, yes, I'm keeping all of that in. Shut up. Good. Uh, this the is fuck the... ups are what we are made out of. That's, that could be our <laughs> fucking channel name. The fuck ups. <laughs> no, just you, Shane. I graduated from college. At least two of the programs I was at. Two of the three programs I was in. Uh, yeah, I didn't, guess. Didn't, didn't you get kicked out of one of your programs for having uh, too low of grades? Uh, yep. Then I got back in, and then I dropped out. <laughs> I'm currently in good standing, though. Which are actually the highest grades I've ever had, with like a 70-something average, I think. <laughs> I just basically dropped out of uh, my business program, because it sucked. You took accounting like 12 times i did i didn't take it that many times i took the first accounting twice or three times finally passed it then took accounting two and failed that twice once because i just stopped once because i didn't understand and so i stopped going and then once because i didn't have time because my other program was way too intensive so i stopped going yeah yeah i mean i probably would have sorry passed, dad i like yeah sorry I dad mean, please I... don't watch these videos I mean, I just have a bunch of student debt, so. Yeah, thankfully my dad covered my tuition. Yep. No, I mean, I probably would have passed had I, like, actually handed things in on time. It was not uncommon for me to start projects after they were due. (laughs) But before the cutoff date. So you only lost, like, like 10% a day or some shit? Yep. After 48 hours, you couldn't hand it in. So as long as I finished it within 48 hours, I was usually okay. But you still lose, like, 10% a day or something, don't you? Yeah, I lose, like, 20% of my mark. So, like, if I had actually handed shit in on time, I'd probably be in, like, the high 80s or 90s. Good lord, Shane. Yeah. I mean, sometimes I would do projects and just forget to hand them in. Remember when we took a programming class together and you did all... It was in, This was in high school, so... Not as bad as if we did this in college. <clears throat> did this in high Your school. Your dad literally came in and, like, you passed my kid no matter what. And he's like, yep. That's not what happened. My dad. That's exactly what happened. That is not what happened. My dad. Well, it's, how the, it's how the teacher understood it, man. That guy knew you were fucking cheating. He was like, pass him. <laughs> pass this. 
So what happened was, let me talk. My dad came in to student teacher night and we were talking to the teacher because I was not doing super well in the class. And this was early on. And the classroom sucked ass. It was very hot. Uh, I remember, God, I used to can I finish my story? Ants in that class. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So my dad asked the teacher, like, can you make sure that my son gets a lot of like extra help so that he can figure this out because he's having a hard time? And the teacher said to my dad, I guarantee you that your son will pass the class. Yeah. And he took that by of just passing you no matter what you handed in. Basically, so what <laughs> happened was Shane would do the assignment and I would take the file and I would was supposed to use this towards doing like making my own file. That was something the teacher actually approved of. Yeah. He approved of people looking at others stuff to use it to and like kind of kind of like in your mind cannibalizing it to figure out how it works and all that. Yeah, you're on the yeah, but he would just change the variable name. I would just change the variables and that kind of stuff and then hand them in. Because I didn't understand what was going on. I don't understand coding for shit. <clears throat> but I didn't want to fail the class. So I handed in basically all the same work as Shane. And the teacher at one point was like, Now, everybody remember, you can't just take the files that you... Like, your friend's files and hand them in as your own. <clears throat> but he never yelled at me and I never got in trouble for it. Um, and I don't know if all this is going to make it in. Because this makes me look out to be a really bad person. But... <clears throat> I don't know. Uh, and at the end of the semester, we had to write an essay on, like, computers and programming and stuff like that, and what computers are used for and all that kind of stuff. And Shane refused to do it. I already had a high enough grade. I was going to pass. I didn't do an extra work when I don't need it. I remember 55, stay alive. <laughs> that was college. It was 50 in high school. But Shane, I remember you saying, I don't think I should have to fucking write a, an essay in a programming class, so I'm not doing it. That is what, yeah. that is what I remember you saying. Sounds like me. Also, I can't really write, so anything that, that, that fucking and different. I wrote this essay and got like a 90% because I was actually really good at writing essays and shit in high school. <clears throat> and like, so we get our final report cards in like July or August of the summer after school ends here in Canada. So we go pick up our, our report cards and Shane pulls out his thing and he's like, I got a 70 whatever in programming. What did you get, Matt? Because he expected me to, because I got a lesser... I didn't do any work. I would get a shit grade. I ended up with an 85. He got above <laughs> me. He and had it, like, one assignment that was worth, like, 10%. It was all the essay, and at the beginning of the course, there was a bunch of small assignments that had to do with translating um, stuff into binary and hex and other forms of stuff that yep. you would never do by hand, which Shane also refused to do. Yeah. So he got zeros, which dragged his grade down. I and... do that a lot. If an assignment isn't worth its fucking weight in the mark, I won't do it. Which costs <laughs> me a lot, too. Yeah. I've had some assignments where it's like, do this thing that'll take you, like, 80 hours. It's worth 2% of your grade. Like, I ain't doing it. I'll take the hit. Yeah. But in the end, uh, since then, I have learned my lesson. I don't do that kind of stuff anymore. Holy. We should talk about fucking English class if you want to fucking talk about fucking some shit, man. All right. Oh and... man, that teacher hated us so much. <laughs> Mostly because we sat in the back laughing our asses off the entire time. <laughs> yep. Yep. Man, I remember doing a presentation in that class, and she was just chatting this, up this... with the kid next to her the entire time. Yeah, this was our writing writers craft class, and she was she Shane... hated us. She, she had know... a good reason to hate us, though. Like we were shits. She she just did not pay attention to Shane's presentations at all, and I. She wouldn't even answer my questions. I was like, so, like, what am I supposed to be doing? My presentation was so far off the fucking ranch. So I had no idea what the fuck to do. There, there I went was... first, first two, by the way. And I started hearing everyone else's assignment. Like, I, ha I went to a completely fucking different location <laughs> than everyone else did. And it doesn't help that you were referencing memes that she didn't get because she was, like, 70. Fair enough. <laughs> like, I don't even like I don't half even of your remember thing. the fucking assignment. All I remember is like I did not do this fucking properly and she talked the <laughs> entire time. Yeah, like half of your thing was just referencing memes that had come out in the last year and like they 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 worked well with your presentation, but obviously your presentation wasn't what she wanted and she didn't understand the memes because she barely knew how to use the computer in our class because she never used any technology in our class other than the like Word document yep. program. Yeah. So, she didn't understand any of that. So. 
Uh, but yeah, uh, she liked she liked me because a lot of my writing was really good, uh, except for one thing that I'm not going to talk about because I don't want to. <laughs> um, so yeah, there was there was stuff where, yeah, but I, I worked for all I worked really hard throughout college and got through all my classes and did really well through that. So <clears throat> I, I learned my lesson. I will never I won't do any of that kind of stuff again. But. It is what it is. I ended up having that teacher for uh, English class, because that was writer's craft class that we had her for first, and I ended up having her for English class later, and she uh, she didn't hate me all that much in that class. It, was, it went pretty well. So now that we're nine minutes into this video, uh, let's actually talk about this game. <clears throat> so this is The Life of Eric Zahn, which is based off of a um, Lovecraft uh, story, because Yahtzee realized that all of the uh, Lovecraft-based games are always about Call of Cthulhu or um, uh, the the Innsmouthers and stuff like that. And so he decided he wanted... Are you still there, Shane? Okay. Uh, this is about when I shut up, actually, because I realized okay. you were just ignoring me and running right through what I was trying to talk about. I wasn't ignoring you. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. This is a different story where there's a guy who is playing a uh, violin. It's actually a viola, I believe, in the original story, which is like a stand-up violin, a big one, like a stand-up bass, kind of, yep. uh, to appease cosmic monstrosities. And so Yahtzee decided, I'm going to make a game about that, because every regular, every other Cthulhu or every other HP Lovecraft-inspired thing is always the Cthulhu, and it's never done very well. So we're going to do the Life of Eric Zahn here, and... This is actually one of my favorite ones. Uh, watch, watch the sky. Watch the sky at night. It. I don't like reading. Yeah. Watch the sky at night. If you see the lines, uh, mimic them with your bow and play. For the love of God, play. So left and right to angle the bow. Hold right mouse button. Okay. Okay, I can do A and oh God, I didn't get to read all that. Well, I guess we're just going to figure well, it out. Oh, well, that's not good. Ah! Well, that didn't work. Nope. Out, yeah. nope, I need to... Uh, quit the title, because I need to... Uh, read what all that said. Yep. Because I didn't get to see it because we were talking. Uh, hold. Okay, so I have to hold right button to touch the right mouse button and then space to uh, draw the bow. That is the bit I didn't see and didn't know what I was right. doing wrong. Do a test real quick. <laughs> what do you mean a test? Just do a test. Test it. There we are. Okay. I don't think I was doing as well as I should have been doing. This is interesting. Yeah. It's pretty cool. I can tell I if you're doing good or not, though. Well, I keep taking health damage, and I'm like, what the hell? I think you're supposed to be angling it. I am. It. Looks like it, though. Like, I'm, do I'm taking damage, and I'm like, I haven't even gotten a chance to angle it right yet. Like, what the fuck, game? Again. And now it's morning, I think, is the... That's what's happening there. Hopefully I will heal between rounds. 
You're still taking damage. I don't think I was. So you can st sleep to refill your stamina bar, or you can study t to refill your inspiration bar. <clears throat> or you can, eventually, you're going to need to busk to, uh, um, to get money, I think. Yep. So I'm sleeping. Right, now, I can, uh, now I can study. Watch this, so I can choose different things. And then you can stu and then you study to bring back your and then I can sleep for a bit to bring back the rest of my stamina and now I can oh, go so that's why your was going down it's stamina yeah and then I can bust to get some money because I think eventually I'm going to have um, to pay my pay my rent and shit like that Yeah, so that's why it was constantly ticking down. We know if we're winning or not, though. Yeah, I have no idea what, uh... I mean, I know there's a light that goes on the... the violin. I wonder if that means you're doing it right. Well, I'm wondering if I'm doing it wrong when it goes... BANG! Psh, psh, psh. Like that. Yeah. Honestly, I have no idea, like, what, if anything, I'm doing right or wrong. I mean, that sounds about right for what they're going for, though. Yeah. I like the idea of Cosmic Horror showing up just, like, critique one dude. Okay, so I think I've kind of figured it out. When the bar is thick and black... Yeah. Oh, yeah, look at that. It goes up, it gets thicker and... You probably want it to be thick. No, I think I don't want it to be thick. It's a lot of button combos that I have to learn. Pretty. Okay. So that's the end of the night. And then I can sleep to get stamina back. Or how much your rent is. And then we'll study. Love and God. Begin study. Sometimes the lines change as I play. All I can do is try to keep up. Am I hurting it? Appeasing it? Or is it m mocking me? So as I study... Uh, we'll learn more, right? Hurting and appeasing. We'll study those. And then we'll bust. You're already... I'm already what? Your bar already uh, maxed out before. Yeah. Oh, well, at least you got some money. Yeah. Sounds like the difficulty is about to go up. Probably. sound good. It did not. I'm doing my best, Cthulhu, I swear. It's not very good at the violin. I'm really like not. Drums.
wouldn't be so hard if my guy stopped fucking re-angling himself every time. Yeah. And it's morning. God. This is difficult. Kinda sucks that you do just sit there for like fucking three hours once it's done. The rent is due in two days. Five francs. Are you paying it? Or am I finding myself a new tenant? Okay. So now I need to do both. I need to do all of that. And sleeping is taking longer to increase my stuff again. Going out. Should probably get some inspiration. You're almost done. Shit. Yeah, you didn't select anything to give you inspiration. I did. I selected five and francs. Five francs? Because I had to do it fast. I think it's paused while you're in the menu. Well, everyone might die today. This is like the show me what you got from fucking uh, Rick and Morty. Never seen that. Great. Seen like half an episode of that. It's great. It's great, Morty. Just it's super. Yellow. It's super dark. I can't fucking see. Yep. Looks like they're, they're fucking pissed off at you. And you're out of juice now. Yup. <laughs> like halfway through the night, they're fuck, fucking mad. <laughs> Well, shit. Come yeah, on, I... dude, I paid good money for the seat. <laughs> it's just like. Oh, I don't like know what's lost. happening. Clock stopped moving. And the whole thing is just black. I don't know if they can see my mouse or not, but... Well, I'm prepared might... for a jump scare. Oh. Okay. <laughs> New high score! <laughs> yep. <laughs> Well, that was interesting. Your mic just made a sound that makes it seem like you might not be uh, talking anymore, so talk and I'll tell you if I can hear you. God damn it. There you are. Uh, just, just in time to end the video. Yep. Don't know how much I've been fucking not there. You've been in it for most of it, but you're, they okay. just made a sound at the end. Yep. So I think that's pretty good. It's way too skill-based yeah, for a, me. It needs a little more... Um, tutorial. A little bit more make tutorial. It, and... It's just like one page where it's like, hey, if it's thin, it's good. If it's thick, it's not. Yeah. And maybe make it a slight bit easier. Yeah, it seemed like you were having a, some difficulty with your mouse jerking all over the place. Yeah. His, like, if I set it to a thing, allow me to pull it across without it, you know, <clears throat> re-angling itself. Because, like, that should be the character being like, okay, I need to do it in this angle, and then he'll continue to do it that way. Yeah, it should, it, like, lock in. It, it kind of takes you it out of the, the bit when you're like, I am this person, when they aren't doing what you told them to do. Because, like, if you are that person, they should do it as instructed. Yeah. Because that's how I would be doing it, and I would leave it at that angle, so they should too. Because that's just kind of how my brain works for video games. At least, what you're, at least what you're trying to do. Yeah. Like, I understand that maybe when you get lower on health or whatever that was up in the top cor the top left, that that could make it wobble a bit. But, anyway. I do like the idea of a cosmic horror killing everyone on the planet just because it didn't get its midnight fucking music. But again, like, get... what if you... What if you're like get properly radio? serenaded? <laughs> yeah. And this takes place back in the day, so there's no radio. 
Because I yeah, heard you say like, something about a radio. Yeah, but like your your it's radio. Like, come oh. on, what the fuck? Why isn't my radio working? Smack, smack, smack. <laughs> then you rip the radio out of the car and chuck it out the window. Yep. And that's the end of the game. Anyway, um, I think 23 minutes is alright. I don't know if all of that is going to be in the thing, or whether we'll take out some of that first bit for a just a, just a random nattering video or something. Maybe. I would combine it with that other video we make that's a decent, uh, decent-sized upload. Because the other one was way too short. Oh, the jumpy music thing? Yeah. 